Welcome to the last part of our news application. We go to developer.google slash YouTube and Android slash player and we select download and download link. We have downloaded the zip file and I will copy it and move to project app lives and I will paste it into lives folder. So we have downloaded the YouTube player. We need to implement this uh, in the Gradle file. So implementation here, the uh, YouTube player. So this, this tutorial, we will uh, play the video uh, when the user click on any thumbnail or any video, it will go and play it in the uh, YouTube player. So the implementation here, uh, we need to uh, get their correct name, the libs folder, and here the YouTube uh, Android player API. Don't make this mistake that I have made because many people made it. I'm showing you how to create the, uh, we use the YouTube player and we have implemented the zip file and not the jar file. I will correct it soon. And uh, I made this video more faster in order to save time for you. And that these uh, we have uh, made many many tutorials about them in the previous videos. So I, I would concentrate on the important part of this video. So the relative part here, the relative sorry uh, layout, the layout of the YouTube player. I will create com dot google dot android dot youtube player dot youtube player view. You see, guys, we have an error here. So what is the problem? As I told you, we go to libs folder and we need to extract, go to libs and copy the jar file. I will remove them all and keep the YouTube Android player API. Copy the name, go to uh, Gradle and correct it. So dot jar. So this is the correct implementation of it. So uh, you see guys, the error has been uh, gone. Now, the layout width, layout height, match uh, wrap content and match parent uh, respectively. And I will give it an ID of YouTube player. And uh, rel I have created a relative layout, sub relative layout inside the big relative layout containing the text views. We need to display some text uh, for the, uh, about the, the video that we have uh, we have uh, parsed or we are playing and uh, this is the match parent for the widths and the height is wrap content and the id channel name and here we have some uh, basic uh, basic constraints and basic layout uh, attributes Okay, so guys, I hope you uh, you benefit from this course, uh, benefit from our uh, YouTube channel, and if there is, uh, and our uh, course, Udemy course, and there if there is any recommendation, I hope you uh, comment it below uh, in the comments, in the description, in the questions, and we are ready to solve your issues. We are ready to, and we hope, and we are happy to hear from you the recommendations, the opinion that you uh, tell us in order to improve in the next uh, courses. And uh, as I promised you, we are making this Udemy course is the biggest and the largest you and Android uh, course on not on Udemy also, but uh, uh, but also in the entire world. It is the biggest and making this a complete Android developer course, the biggest and the largest course on the internet. So I hope you rate us five stars on Udemy and subscribe to our YouTube channel in order to push us forward making daily contents, daily uploads and daily lessons. Okay, back to Android Studio. As you see, we are making some, uh, some uh, XML codes and I need to create a recycler view. So uh, the recycler view here will contain also the text views and in uh, under, I need to below uh, the label similar news. Okay, labelers, label, okay. 
Now let's go to the YouTube video activity and I need to initialize the to initialize and declare the views first and then initialize them into the on create view and then we will add the method called initiate initiate view view title find view by ID and adding the video title also the channel name and label similar I would make it as label similar and everything till now working fine now let's let's add here the visibility to gone inside the text view and recycler view also and the recycler view here video underscore recyc YouTube video player we need to extend the YouTube base activity so this is the very important part that you need to extend YouTube base activity now view dot set on click listener when the user we go to YouTube uh, adapter when the user click on the uh, on the uh, the video we need to play it so I'm I'm uh, implementing the on click listener set on click listener and inside inside the on click method I have created white yt model an instance of yt model and I'm making an intent that takes us to the uh, takes us to YouTube video activity and parses the data which uh, video the user has been clicked and don't miss to add the URI in order to get and parse the get thumbnails that get default dot get URL so we are getting the URL and just passing it to the video player that we have created inside YouTube video activity. I dot put extra VID. We are passing the video ID. Okay. And I will make a, just a little text and uh, just a little um, test. Sorry. And uh, just to get the ID. If we are getting the ID correctly, I will start exam and then run the code. And we go to master coding and we click. You see, guys, we have uh, parsed the video ID correctly. Amazing. Now we need to pass this ID to the uh, to the activity that we have created, which is the YouTube video activity, and display and tell the the video player, hey and take this URL and get the video and display the video inside this uh, this uh, player. I would put extra, we are putting the video ID, the channel ID, the channel name, and the title of the video, okay? So these are the characteristics that we want to display them into the video activity. We go to video activity, YouTube video activity. CID get intent that get extra. We are making and getting the the extra title also, and we need to get the channel name in the same way video title dot set text to title channel name dot set text channel name and label similar dot set text more from c name so youtube player view dot initialize get the string R dot string Google API and I need to initialize it like this so we need to implement the player and we have the two methods we have implemented the two methods 
uninitialization success and uninitialization uh, failure and queue video and we pass the video id and here we go we have this video id is passed correctly and we are getting the video uh, correctly okay amazing guys we need to make some tweaks for the uh, the video uh, player because it's making it at the full screen i need uh, and also the details is not uh, is not uh, shown i will go and add the uh, amendments so we are kings yes we are hopefully after 40 uh, parts of this video at uh, this uh, uh, project we have make it made it as correctly and amazing application ready if you want you can uh, publish it on play store and the next videos we are going to uh, to uh, add add mob the 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 advertisements and then we need to show you how to upload the applications on play store so amazing guys we have done and we deserve five stars after this big uh, and a subscribe after this big applications that we have done thank you guys see you next projects